midday break at this UN run school in Nablus. Playing without a care in the world, the girls here know they've already made history. Three 14 year old girls among them have invented a revolutionary cane for the blind and are now representing Palestine in San Jose, California at an Intel sponsored international science fair for the youth. We caught up with the inventors, Asil, Noor and Asil, as they finalized their preparations with their science teacher, Jamila. They tell me it took them six months of research and trials to come up with the cane, which they call stick tech. You can turn the volume up or down. There are two buzzers, one for the front sensor and another for the ground sensor. The handle also vibrates in two different places. This is because some users may also be deaf, so the vibrators would alert them of what's ahead, whether it's an obstruction or a flight of stairs or even a hole. The girls are the youngest of three Palestinian teams now in Intel Science Fair. They earned their seat after winning a national science competition a few weeks ago. I'm very excited. I will see America for the first time and represent my country. I feel like I am shouldering a big responsibility. This project was a labor of love and sacrifice, with the headmistress funding the project from the school's limited funds. I think so that uh, my students proud of their project and I'm proud of them and our project. And I think so, uh, it doesn't matter that we live in difficult circumstances if we have the energy to make better things. Mm -hmm. The young inventors are refugees living in Nablus's Askar refugee camp. The product of a reality of poverty and limitations, their achievement has brought cheer here and offered hope for a better future. People here don't care if the girls win the competition in California. They're already proud three inventors were born. Nur Al Jazeera, the Askar refugee camp.